Bart, everybody. We are back. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, fine show tonight. Fine show coming up tomorrow night. Billy Bob Thornton going to be joining us. Yes, from Saturday night. Saturday Night Live, Maya Rudolph will be joining us, and musical guest The Calling. So watch that show. That's going to be a good one. I swear to you. Why not? Uh, folks, my next guest can currently be seen in... Conan! Folks, it's our announcer, Joel Goddard. Yes, Joel? It's time. It's time for what, Joel? Time for my year-end review for 2002. <laughs> 2002 year in review. The year is seven days old, Joel. Well, I suppose you want me to wait until the end of the year, like every other schmo. Well, I have news for you, Conan. This isn't Wake Up Sheboygan. It's a network talk show. We've got to stay ahead of the competition. Yeah, but Joel, it, Joel, it just doesn't make sense. It's, it's seven days into the Thanks, year. Thanks, Conan. It's time now to look back at the year that was, 2002. Two thousand and two will be forever remembered as the most dismal year in history. In two thousand and one, over two hundred sixty-two billion shares were traded on the New York Stock Exchange. As of today, January seventh, two thousand and two, only four billion have been traded. That's a ninety-eight percent drop. That means we'll soon be roaming the streets in burlap sacks, digging through garbage cans for even the tiniest morsel of food. <laughs> Yeah, but, but Joel, we're only one week. And Are you a sports fan, Conan? <laughs> kind of. Too bad, because 2002 is shaping up to be a complete disaster. Remember Barry Bonds? He hit a record 73 home runs in 2001. How many has he hit this year? Zero. <laughs> in fact, this aging prima donna hasn't even played in any games. Barry, way to let us all down. <laughs> Yeah, but Joel... It... And sorry to bring you into this, Conan, but you didn't fare any better in 2002, the year in which you lost your mind. What are you talking about, I lost my mind? Well, after eight seasons averaging almost 200 shows per year, your output dwindled to only four shows so far in 2002. A sure sign that a certain unnamed talk show host has hit the crack pipe. <laughs> What do you mean, unnamed? You just said that it's me. If that's not a confession, I don't know what is. 2002, a year we'll all be glad to be rid of. <laughs> we'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Ryan Phillippe, when we return, stick around.